Hi guys! So today, I'm going to show you how he lives. Hashtag Bedsita Chronicles. So, join me. <laughs> okay, now I've said so many souls, but it is what it is. Join me! So, let's do this! Yeah, the house is open, but he's nowhere to be seen. <laughs> so, don't expect you'll see anyone. Anyway, welcome home. Yeah, so guys, uh, this is the apartment tour. Don't worry, it's a uh, man's cave, so he's watching football. So, I'll start with the lunch area. So, for the lunch, uh, he has fully furnished it with a sofa. And uh, the sofa, this is a five seater sofa, so the house is quite spacious. And then uh, you come here, he has a brown carpet, which is actually advantageous because you know, in, in these houses with ceramic tiles, it gets really cold at night. So, if you have a carpet and it's really fluffy and comfy, and I just want to sleep here, but I can't. Yeah, so yeah, you see, there's, there's a TV stand here with a Wi-Fi, you need a Wi-Fi thingy <laughs> and a hoofa and the TV, this is a 32 inch and uh, there is a table here, the plastic table which is put to laptops I don't know for what reason, it is what it is <laughs> for men, for men, <laughs> these creatures I'll never understand them why I have two laptops, <laughs> but it's okay so yeah, this is the sofa let me just get behind so that you see the entire living area. So yeah. Here. Yes. So now we come to the bedroom. Ouch. See the things I hustle just to produce a video. You guys have to pay me. So on the bedroom there's the bed and it's quite a huge bed. A five by six bed with a really fluffy duvet. However, it will change this. I told him to change this because this is too plain. <laughs> you know, this house needs a feminine touch. And those curtains, he's also changing them. And the bedding area, we also have the curtain box with the curtain, the bed and the huge duvet and two pillars and a fluffy small pillow. And now he's hung his bag in his wall, his clothes on the wall. So yeah, that's it. Then, uh we now have the kitchen area in the kitchen area he's put a stool which he's put the gas on top because you know he's quite tall you know for me the gas being on the floor is on my level so <laughs> there's no <laughs> there's no problem <laughs> but since he's quite tall he's put the mini and he was cooking baby is quite a good cook so ah, let me not show the contents of his sufuria and then uh the sink area with cupboards and the utensil stand, the plastic utensil rack, and the shelves where he's put the cereals, the yeah, the utensils, the unga, tomato sauce, and soy sauce. Because this is the one thing that this guy can't live without. And like a soy sauce, kwaki laki tu, si shtuki ataki paka komkati. Yeah, and then uh, the cupboard. He's bought so many things. Yeah, I think I'll leave on a shopping jersey. <laughs> yeah. And then after that, we don't come to the passage, which I can um, turn here 20 liters because you're not staying in Nairobi. You might not have what I need. I'm saying you need quite some storage. Then the sink area, and there's quite a cute mat here. This is really cute. Hey, congrats, Mazi. <laughs> and then uh, the dustbin, the sink area. The tiles on the wall, the mirror, the shelf, and on top of the shelf is placed his grooming stuff. The token area, yeah, curtains, and now the washroom, yeah. And this is mostly the common arrangement for most uh, bed sitters in Nairobi. So after that, he got the washroom. The washroom has the toilet. The, the the water closet in the system of the system and the overhead shower the shower it also has it also has a soap holder area and uh, a window 
where you can put your other accessories it also has a section down there where you can put like him has put the brush and so and any other thing that you can put all those fancy fancy stuff mm -hmm. the bucket so this is the toilet in short let me just go the toilet to see it so that's it for today guys uh i hope you enjoyed this house tour it's just a simple house tour and it's my first so uh, forgive me for all the errors and everything but i hope you enjoyed it and despite this house looking this fancy they're still going to glam it up and give it the feminine touch huh? that thing that we always look for in a house so you can give your suggestions yeah so give us suggestions on the things that you'd like us to add to the house on a budget and uh, we might just include your things so that's it for today like share subscribe and do all those things that you usually do we'll really appreciate and thank you so much for the support bye guys see you next time Woo